Hi, today I'm going to show you how to create this beautiful rainbow rubber band bracelet. In order to make one, all you need is tiny rubber bands and you can find them absolutely anywhere. They're super popular right now. I got mine from CVS and it is good to get them in different colors since we're creating a rainbow bracelet. I got, I got pink, green, orange, purple and yellow. Uh, you also need a drawing pen. This is gonna be super helpful. So first we are going to take yellow rubber band and then we will also take three pink, three pink rubber bands what you're gonna do with three rubber pink rubber bands, you will basically align them together and then line them up this way, right? Okay, and then you you're you're going to take your yellow band and you're gonna put it around your pink rubber bands. Now what you're going to do, you're going to take one end of your yellow band and you're going to pass it through the other end of your yellow band. This way you're going to tie up both, all, all of the, um, all three uh, pink rubber bands together. So this is what you should have at the very beginning, okay? Now this yellow rubber band, we're going to put it around the nail to keep the bracelet in place. Now we're gonna take another yellow rubber band and three green rubber bands. What I'm gonna do now, you will basically fold each pink rubber band together. Okay, so here is the first one. You are going to take the pink one, you're gonna fold it like that, right? You have one end of the pink rubber band here and you have another end of your rubber band here, right? You're gonna take the yellow rubber band, you're gonna put it between and then you're gonna pass your first green rubber band through both ends of the pink rubber band here, okay? There you go. Now, when you look at your green rubber band here, it also has one end here and the other then end on the opposite side. You're gonna go back to your yellow rubber band that is basically trapped between the pink rubber band and you're gonna put it between the green rubber band right here, between two sides. So just take it, put it between them. There you go, that's all you need to do. And take your drawing pin and pin the green, green edges together. Put it to the side. Now you're gonna do exactly the same thing with your second rubber band. So you're gonna take both ends, here is your first end of rubber band number two, here is your second end of rubber band number two. Before you fold them together, you're gonna take that yellow rubber band and you're gonna put it between, between, the, pink, uh, between the pink one. Right here. There you go. See, so the yellow one is again between the pink rubber band. Now we're, we're gonna take your second green rubber band right here and we will pass it through both ends of the pink rubber band again, okay? Fold it together and pass it through the pink one. There you go. Now you have two ends of the green one. So you go back to your green rubber band, uh, to your yellow rubber band, and again, you're gonna put it between two of your green ends of your rubber band here. 
Now you're gonna take your second drawing pin and you're gonna hold the second green uh, rubber band together. Now we're going to your third pink rubber band that is right here, okay? Again, you're gonna fold it together like that. But before you fold it, you're gonna take that yellow rubber band, put it between the pink one, let me show, let me do it in a way so you can see it. There you go, okay? Now the yellow one is between pink rubber band. And you're gonna take your third green rubber band, you're gonna, you're gonna push it through your pink one, there you go. And then again, before you fold your green one, you're gonna take the other side of the yellow one, which is right here, and you're gonna put it between the green ones. There you go. This way, the yellow rubber band is between the pink and the green one. And now you're gonna take your third drawing pin and pin the green rubber band together. It, the drawing pin just helps you keep everything in place. Okay, so we're taking, we're ta we're taking another yellow rubber band and we're moving on to three orange uh, rubber bands. So we're gonna remove the first drawing pin that is that holds the green rubber band together and again the yellow one is gonna go between the green between two edges of the green rubber band right so we're putting it between them there you go now we're gonna take our orange rubber band and we're gonna put it between through the um, two um, ends of the green rubber band, okay? So, put it through. There you go, it's coming out. We got it, okay. So again, we're gonna take the other, we're gonna go back to the yellow rubber band and we will put it between the orange one. Okay, so now your rubber band, let me show you this way. Oh. Hold it together, hold it together. There you go, okay. So now your, that's your second yellow rubber band. It's between the green one and the orange one. See it from the side? It's between the green and the orange one. So what you're gonna do with the orange rubber band, pin it together. Moving on to your second green rubber band. You're gonna remove the drawing pin. So you, you have two edges of your green rubber band. You're gonna take your yellow rubber band and put, put it between the green one right here. Now, you're gonna take your second orange rubber band and you're gonna put it through the openings fold it together and put it through your green rubber band, both ends. Now that you passed your second orange rubber band through the green one, before you're gonna fold it, you're gonna take the second side of your yellow one, right, right here, don't forget about the second, the, the yellow rubber band, and you're gonna put it between the, uh, two, between the um, two ends of orange one. There you go. Now, you're going back to your drawing pin, pin it together to hold it in one place, and it's done. Moving on to your third green rubber band. You're gonna take your yellow one, that's your second yellow one, 
put it between So you're going to take your second yellow rubber band and you're going to put it between the green one, right? Between the two ends of the green one, right? Right here, right here in the middle. So you're taking this. There you go. Okay. Now you're going to align the green rubber band together in a way that you can pass your uh, orange, third orange rubber band through. There you go, your, your, your third orange rubber band is right here. And again, before you fold it together, take the other side of the yellow rubber band and put it around the orange one and you pin it together now we're, we're gonna take three purple rubber bands and another yellow rubber band and here we go again so going back to the first orange rubber band which is right here here you have two ends you're gonna put the yellow rubber band between them there you go now you're gonna align the orange both ends of the orange rubber band together and then you're gonna take your purple rubber band and you're gonna pass it through There you go, you got it. And again, before you fold your purple rubber band together, you're gonna go back to your yellow rubber band and pass it through between two ends of your purple one. And then you can fold it and pin it together. You're going to do exactly the same thing with your second orange rubber band. You're going to take two ends of your orange rubber band and you're going to take your yellow one right here, pass it between the orange one. There you go. Okay, so again the yellow one is between the two ends of the orange rubber band. Now align it together in a way so you can pass the purple one, the second purple rubber band, through the orange one. Push it through. And again, before you fold your purple rubber band, you're gonna pat you're gonna pass the yellow one between between it, okay? And now you can pin it together. Moving on to your third orange rubber band, and you do exactly same thing. You're gonna put the yellow one, which is right here, between the two ends of orange rubber band. Let me grab it better. And then you're going to align both ends of the yellow rubber band in a way so you can pass your third purple rubber band through.
and again before you fold your purple rubber band together you want to go back to your yellow one which is right here you're gonna go back to your yellow one which is right here and you're gonna pass it between your purple one you're gonna align two ends of purple rubber band and pin it together and we're going back to the pink rubber band again and you basically repeat the same process over and over until your bracelet is long enough uh, in order to close it around your hand Once your bracelet is long enough to wrap around your hand, what you're gonna do, um, basically just grab another yellow rubber band and then remove the first drawing pin, pass your yellow rubber band through the pink one, there you go. Now remove the second drawing pin and again continue, just continue passing your yellow one through the second pink one. So you're going to do the same thing with your third pink uh, rubber band. Just take the yellow one and pass it through the pink one. There you go. So what you're going to do now, take one end Take one end of your yellow rubber band and pass it through the other end of your yellow band. And just pull. Now in order to connect both ends together, you can, for example, use a paper clip. Um, you can also use safety pin to hold it together. But I'm going to use a green um, ribbon that will basically hold the whole bracelet together. And let me show you how it's gonna look on your hand. So this is the front of, of your rainbow rubber band bracelet. And this is 
the inside of your rubber band bracelet. 